This is Mahmoud Hassan Manas. Welcome to another solution tutorial of Soyros. Today we are going to solve this 3D problem. In this 3D problem, this is the isometric view and all the dimensions are given in the isometric view. So first of all, I will start drawing from this portion. Okay. For drawing this portion, we can see uh, from this point to this line, it has a distance of, uh, as the total distance is 50 diameter, so this half distance will be uh, 25 unit. Then we can see this line has a dimension of 65 unit then this line as the total dimension is 90 unit so the half dimension will be 45 unit as usual and if we cut this 15 unit so that this dimension will be uh, 50, 45 unit minus 15 unit minus 10 unit okay after that uh, we can see we have this line and this line has a dimension of 45 unit then we can see the total offset is 10 unit so as the total offset is 10 unit we will offset this portion okay after offsetting this portion we can see uh, this portion has a dimension 35 unit so i will draw a 35 unit line then i will draw another line like here then we will trim this portion okay so after that we will mirror this other portion and then i will extrude boss and for extrude bossing we can see it has a extrude boss of 40 unit so after that we can see that we have a circular profile here like here and this circular profile has a dimension of 70 radius and we can see two extruder circle one is here and another is here and this extruder circle has a dimension of 12 diameter and it has a distance of 25 unit from here okay so let me demonstrate all of this so first of all i will start drawing from the top plane so i am selecting the top plane here now I sketch now normal to it now select the line tool and place the line tool here so this horizontal dimension here will be 50 divided by 2 unit okay after that we have a uh, vertical dimension and this vertical dimension is 65 unit then we have another horizontal dimension and this horizontal dimension will be 90 divided by 2 so it, it will be 45 minus 50 unit minus 10 unit so it will be 20 unit after that we have another horizontal dimension and this horizontal dimension has 45 unit okay now in here we we have a offset of 10 unit so i am going to select the offset in this and select this line and now press ok so we have offset this line now we need to draw other line so select the line tool again and we from this point we have a vertical line of 35 unit okay drawing a vertical line of 35 unit then closing the shape okay we have drawn our shape now it's time for trim option go to trim option and trim all the unnecessary part okay we have trimmed all the unnecessary part now select the line tool again because we need to close these two points so i'm selecting this line and this line we have closed this point now press ok after that we need to uh, mirror this portion for mirroring this portion select the mirror entities and in this to be mirror we need to mirror this this portion and mirror about and mirror about this line okay now press ok after that select the trim option again and trim this part now press ok now isometric it for a better view now go to features and now extrude boss now extrude boss it to 40 unit okay extrude bossing it to 40 unit i will i will reverse it and uh, now press ok so we have drawn this portion now we need, we need to draw a circular profile here for drawing the circular profile i will select this face now I sketch now normal to it after that uh, i will select the circle and draw a circle uh, okay draw a circle here and this circle has a dimension of 70 radius so seven, uh, so the distance total di total diameter will be, will be 70 multiplied by 2 okay it after drawing that circle select the dimension tool and dimension this point to this origin line the vertical distance will be 25 unit okay so setting this vertical distance to oh sorry this vertical distance will be 20 unit because okay this distance is 20 unit now press ok after that select this line and make sure to convert entities okay after that zoom it here and select the middle point okay 
selecting the middle point and also select this circle after selecting both of them select the coincident from here okay now press ok after that select uh, select this line and control click this line now convert into this now select the trim option and trim all the necessary part that we don't need now press ok now i submit ticket for a better view now go to features now extrude cut now extrude cut we need to extrude cut these two portions so i'm selecting this portion and this lower portion okay we need to extrude cut these two portion now select this arrow now extend it now press ok so this portion has been done now we need to draw the extrude cut circle for doing that extrude circle i'll select this face now sketch now normal to it now select the circle here and place the circle to the middle at the middle point here okay and place in the circle and this circle has a dimension of uh, 12 unit okay now select the smart dimension and dimension this point to this line this distance is 20 unit okay and from this line to this line the dimension is 25 unit okay the dimension is 25 unit now i submit ticket for a better view now go to features and now it should cut now select it should cut through all both now press ok so this portion has been done now we need to draw all the circular portion for drawing all the circular portion uh, circular portion we can see that uh, we have this circular profile and this circular profile has a dimension of 50 diameter and it has a dimension of here you can see 30 unit this portion is 30 unit this upper portion and the total distance is 80 unit so this upper portion is 30 unit then we have 40 unit and we have 10 units so it will be made, make total of 80 unit okay after that we can see we have another circular profile like here and this circular profile has a dimension of 35 unit and it has a uh, extrude boss of 16 unit and we can see we have another extrude cut circle in this inner portion and this extrude cut circle has a dimension of 20 unit and we will extrude cut it to through all okay so i am selecting this face now sketch now normal to it after select and place it here now select the circle and place the circle here and dimension it to 50 diameter now i submit it for a better view now go to features now is to boss now this is to boss it to upper portion 30 degree 30 unit and select direction 2 and in the direction 2 dimension it to 40 plus 10 unit okay now press okay so it will be give total 80 unit after that select the upper face of the circle again now sketch now normal tweet now select another circle and place the circle here and draw a circle of 35 diameter now press ok now i submit it for a better view now go to features and now it should boss now it should boss it to 16 unit now press ok after that select the upper face again now sketch now normal to it now select a circle and place the circle here now dimension this circle to 20 diameter 20 diameter okay now i submit it for a better view now go to features now it should cut now is to cut it to through all now press ok so as you can see we have drawn our theory case thank you for watching till the end thanks for watching and keep learning be different